Well, I'm at Chirk Castle, and which you can see there in the background behind me. And it's a mild, muggy day, and, it, and it's rather lovely here today. Um, I'm just going to show you around. Um, as we go around, you can see the beautiful views that the owners of this castle would have had over the years. And here there's this path that's been mown through the meadow here. And the idea is in July, uh, when all these um, weeds are fully flowering, um, it will be a wonderful place to come and walk. And it's a deliberate act to help the environment here at the castle. Um, but there is a walkway through, and the idea is that next month particularly, um, it will be a really lovely place to come. Uh, and then just over this way, uh, there's a wood belt, which is rather nice. I've just seen a pheasant go in there, hiding from me, which is fair enough. And uh, you can see the, the gardens over there, maybe. <clears throat> maybe I'll sort of just try and zoom in a little bit. And um, there's some lovely topiary there too. So um, maybe I'll do another little movie in a minute. So uh, stay tuned. Here I am at Offers Dyke, and you can just see the shape of it here. And Offers Dyke was constructed in the 8th century as a division between Mercia and Wales, and is still here. And it dissects the Cherk estate, which came along. The castle was built at the end of the 13th century, it's about 400 years later. And um, this is a very peaceful and wonderful part of the estate, away from the mowing of the, and the busyness of the castle. Uh, but it's very peaceful, lots of wildlife around, and it's uh, just lovely. <laughs> 